So we're at 26.30 right now. Um, it's about three quarters of the way into this, this fight. You guys just had a massive team fight, and now you're going to push mid again, right? Yep. Um, we just we did have a pretty successful team fight. Uh, I got in there, did a lot of damage, and now we can uh, just go ahead and uh, attack their tower pretty freely here. Yep. Poppy is going to Poppy's trying to defend. Goes down. <laughs> she goes down pretty quickly. Very quickly. Evelyn's coming to help you guys, right? Yeah, she wants. She definitely wants you know to assist us in, uh, in losing this game right here. She's actually she's the enemy carry. She's the carry for the other team right now. Yeah, she's carrying. All right, she's carrying mm -hmm. uh, bonuses for the other team. She's gotten the most kills for them, definitely. Now you guys just took out a tower, but you're uh, you're falling back now. Yeah, we uh, we got pretty low, and uh, they all respawned, so not going to take any chances there with uh, respawns. Mm -hmm. Looks like people are going to. Uh, Reset back to base and uh, buy some items, <laughs> and uh, and just relax is just like feeding all kinds of information. They all back. They all going to heal. Push top and bot. <laughs> yeah, I even I even like uh, she says, uh, "LOL, these guys really want to win, don't they?" Yep. Stuff like that. More guys are also saying, uh, like I said, we can't win without you. Stuff mm -hmm. like that. But he doesn't know. And uh, Triggy Lolcat says, I find it amazing that we are winning even though you're feeding them hardcore. <laughs> yep, we've had the uh, the advantage in all the team fights and uh, it's just going pretty well for us. They, uh, they're being pushed a lot. We're definitely beating them in towers and uh, beating them in team fights. Just really outplaying them pretty hard. I'd say so. They're, uh, they must be worried at this point that uh, their, their feeding isn't quite enough. To, uh, to dominate maybe as much as they thought they would. Yeah, and this is a this is a pretty good team fight. Um, I get in there with my ult. I take down two people pretty fast. Run back, um, just uh, help finish up the kill on Vayne, and then uh, I stay alive. Alistair can't kill me. Yep. So you guys are more worried about going for the uh, for the base. Yeah. People people get distracted a lot in these games where. Um, Someone will get a lot, stay alive, and they'll get distracted by it. Especially the tanks. Sometimes the tanks will just run off in the opposite direction, and everyone wants to follow them and make sure they get the ace. But uh, it's really not worth it because you can just keep pushing, and the tank's not really going to do anything about it. It's about killing the nexus, not getting the kill. Yeah. So here you are. You're at. Uh, you're literally at their final towers, pushing, but uh, you fall back. It's 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 not strong enough. Your team isn't strong enough to finish it at this point. No, definitely not. Um, I'm less than half. Mordecai's is less than half. Uh, we got in there. We killed the uh, the inhibitor, which is a huge advantage. Uh, the lane is going to push itself now. They're going to have to uh, give up at least a little bit of vision if they don't want those minions pushing their base by having someone you know keep it keep it pushed. Mm -hmm. Yep. It just said a minion has destroyed a turret. So that's <laughs> uh, that's that's top right. And there goes Gangplank. He's trying to uh, trying to slow things down over there. But uh, yeah, like you said. Um, you, you you guys have kind of a, a good game now, like with your team, and but you're not trying to be too reckless about it. You were in there, right there. Uh, I think that was Jarvin that was saying finish it, but uh, but you're playing <laughs> it safe. Yeah, you uh, you can definitely be too reckless in games and g just completely give up a game by uh, thinking you know you're in a good position for Baron and you don't even have you know the map worded. You don't have vision on any of them. You go for Baron, you lose it, and then you know you lose the game that way. Uh, you stick around, stick around too much in their base, and then you get um, you get wiped, and then you, they actually will push a tower on you, which yep. is a huge disadvantage. Yep. And uh, that's just something you can avoid by just you know going in, getting something done, taking an inhibitor down, mm -hmm. and then just uh, moving back and not losing anything out of that. You know. Mm -hmm. and it looks like we've got uh, Poppy and uh, uh, Alistair on bottom. Looks like they're trying to uh, to defend the. Uh, the, their own lanes and uh, and also do some farming. You think that they want some uh, some better items? Like maybe they're thinking uh, they're uh, they need some more stuff. Maybe they need some uh, some new defense, uh, some new attack. Yep, they definitely need some more items if they're gonna want to win team fights. Because as it's been going, we've we've been doing pretty well in team fights. Um, just you know clearing them pretty fast and then going and pushing something. And they're definitely gonna need to uh, farm up some items and get something if they want to win. Uh, it's pretty funny, actually, in the uh, chat, uh, Mordekaiser mentioned, are they letting us win, or are they just as bad as Eve, you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I like, like that. Like, how is this happening? Yeah, it, it's almost surreal. I, I said to uh, 
to the, my YouTube viewers and said, "You guys aren't gonna believe this. Like, it's just, it's not even about the kills. It's just, it, it's the whole situation of it is just so, it's so rare, so, so unbelievable. I don't know. Yeah. Like, I never thought I'd see something like this in, in ball. So it's, it's actually really, really fun sometimes to watch your replays. Uh, but it looks like you got, uh, you got taken out by Poppy. Who's a pretty big team fight going on right now, mid." Yeah, I took a lot of uh, unexpected damage uh, from Poppy. Uh, I didn't think she'd been doing that good, but I guess she had enough items um, along with Alistair, Vayne, and Annie actually all the damage to me. And what killed me was the was the um, the Annie tigger. So I just took a lot of unexpected damage, and it was I was taking damage before I wanted to ult. I was just out of position, and I was probably distracted by something, or maybe actually I was too overconfident that I was going to win. I don't, not uh, who knows, you know. So your team isn't doing too bad. They they still went on to. Uh to keep pushing a little bit, they, they had the momentum after, even after that death. Yeah, I was I was pretty surprised because um, you know four v win is hard enough to win, and now I get taken out uh, you know like that, and then they actually just go ahead and they just push in, they just keep pushing, which is pretty good. Um, and now they're getting chased down a bit though, and uh, looks like I'm back up though, so I'm on my way over there. Poppy just died to uh, the Jenna. <laughs> Gangplank's cool. Yeah. Yep, there's that there that you vein. Are. You're yeah, I vein just now. run in. I kind of whiff my ult a bit. I only get like one hit off on vein, and this is a pretty cool clip uh, coming up, where uh, <laughs> vein's just running around that corner, and you know oh. I, just, I, sh I shoot my skill shot around that corner. You know, no no sight at all. You yep. know, just in the fog of war, and uh, take her out, which is uh, feels pretty good in, in any situation. You know, you're winning, you're losing. You know, hitting some type of skill shot through a wall like that is always fun. Always something that you know shows you're doing. You're playing pretty well, playing at the top of your game. Yeah, you're you're definitely in the zone right now. It's it's awesome to see something like that happen. I've, I've seen it in like Freaks Champion Spotlight videos, but uh, it's it's a rare occasion. But it's really really fun to watch. Yep, definitely something that's uh, always fun to happen to you. Yep. But uh, Evelyn runs in there again, just uh, just dies uh, to Annie, gives her another stack on her mage eyes, mm -hmm. and uh, now she's up. She only has eight stacks of mage eyes. She's actually been buying, dying enough to keep those stacks below ten, I think, throughout this entire game, which is pretty unfortunate for her, especially since they're just completely feeding, or that Evelyn is just completely feeding. And our our minions take down another turret um, up in top as well here. Yep. They're, because the minions are doing uh, <laughs> doing a lot of work for you guys yeah. now. Definitely doing work. Uh, that's one thing about taking down inhibitors. It's, it's such a huge advantage because um, all of your minions actually get an advantage. So they're all going to start pushing the towers, which puts a lot of pressure on the other team yep. um, to split up and to have to keep their lanes pushed. Mm -hmm. So that allows your team to, to keep grouping back up and to pushing a single lane while they, they're distracted trying to uh, defend against the uh, the other lanes from super minions. Yep, and uh, coming up here, Gangplank uh, is just going for red, but mm -hmm. he goes down pretty quickly. Uh, or just died to end. So <laughs> yeah, he got a, a he got a big cocky. There. He thought, uh, I guess he thought he was too tanky. He's only got a Rallies, uh, Force of Nature, Sunfire. Mm -hmm. He just runs in there. He got he dies kind of meaninglessly. Look at this. Relax in, in chat. It's like care, care. Ken yeah. ult. <laughs> the cannon ult is up. Everyone, watch out for cannons ult because I've just been destroying them with it. They have no defensive items, like I said. Um, without defensive items, and you're up against someone like a uh, cannon that can just run in there, kind of, kind of freely, unless he gets peeled. Really, he can, um, you know, just do whatever he wants. And here I go, um, going with my cannon ult. Although yeah. Jarvin wasn't really there to help me. Uh, yeah, yeah, he kind, he kind of ran away. I thought maybe we could go in and uh, I could get a couple kills, especially on that Vayne and Annie that had been dying pretty quickly. Mm -hmm. But uh, he he decides to just run away, which isn't too bad. At least he got away. We only lost one person there, but we um. We lost everyone except uh, Jarvin, but just um, in that one Jarvin situation. Jarvin came a bit late. <laughs> yeah. Could have been there earlier. Well, Mordecai is especially you know, complaining because he was just sitting in there while we were killing Gangplank. He should have really been more with the team. Mm -hmm. And then even here's um, here's Evelyn giving some advice. Yeah. Like, they will push together with more next time. Mm -hmm. You know, watch out and everything. Got a, uh, another team fight going on closer to your base now. Vayne goes down by Jarvin, though. And uh, just uh, more than who is that? Oh, that's that's just relax. <laughs> that's Evelyn. She doesn't even know what to do. She doesn't know. Should I go in right now? Will it will it even hurt them if I if I you know come out of stealth and then uh -huh. there she goes. She comes out of stealth and dies again. Yeah, just lost another tower though. So it's not over yet. Like we 
were, mm -hmm. you, were you really confident, or were you like, well, this is still kind of even? Well, I had pushed, um, we, we had won all the team fights, so in my view, it was, it looked like as if we were going to win at that point. And then when they did get, um, they did get that huge uh, kill on us, they had four of us down, and they were able to push that tower. That was something that, you know, kind of made me like, alright, we definitely have to give up, you know, stay focused and everything. Well, that tower isn't isn't too important because it doesn't defend a um, an inhibitor. It's still you know something losing a tower like that. You know, I don't want that to happen. I'm and just this reading, is just relax. This is comments. the best part of the. Yep, this yeah, is it. This is the. This big is the one best here. part of the entire game. They are they're going for Baron, and that's something that would be really bad for us. Uh, according to Eve's advice too, she's like, yeah. he's like, go Baron, go Baron. Yeah, as something after especially you want to do right after you win a huge team fight. You know, you go push a tower and then you fall back and do Baron. Uh, that's you know a way you can get a huge advantage on the other team right after yeah. Uh, Your teammates yeah, giving yeah, loads of advice like Kenny yeah. coming care zero wards. <laughs> she's definitely she's trying to carry them. She's uh -huh. doing her, her best to carry the other team. Yep, you know that like he really wants you guys to lose. Like after after all that bullshit that he went through, you know all this time he does he yeah. doesn't want to see you guys come back at all. Yeah, putting putting that much effort into the enemy uh, team winning, and then you know something like you know going like this is something you know pretty pretty demoralizing for him. Yeah. But this is saying, this, this you know, must be really interesting for you to and, and kind of sort of like a confidence booster, I guess, in in your own abilities, like the abilities of of a team that that's missing a player that you can still have a good game like this and now it's you're going over to Baron and there it is yep. everybody's there you they have ulted and all that red god yeah they, they took a lot of damage or that one person especially dropped from my ult and then uh, I still just ran through with my speed uh, did a bunch of damage with that combo and that's they it. pretty much get aced and <laughs> that's that's the biggest thing that had happened. I mean, a 5v4, uh, <laughs> them having Baron, which just, you know, that's something that, like, how could that happen, you know? Yep, you guys just burned through those minions. Like, there's nothing left now. There's, there's Evelyn. <laughs> Evelyn just has an all chat. Oh my god. Oh my god. And then Jarvis just, like, finish. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> More of you guys are wow, lol. There's Using that tower. Oh. Other towers going down really quickly now. <laughs> even Poppy's laughing on the other team. Like, yeah. what, I, I can't well, even imagine like what they must be thinking. Yeah, I mean, you lose some pretty bad games that. sometimes, but... Oh, that's it's over. Game yep. over. Good get on game. my level. <laughs> yeah, I was just like, get on my level. Oh, like, that was amazing. <laughs> that was really, really epic, dude. Like, I, I, I'm going to keep this in my collection forever this is this video is going permanently into my my vids folder for all time and I'm, we're gonna be looking at this like a couple years later and, and it's still gonna be entertaining <laughs> i think yep that's Dude. it's so fun because you know i i hate being at low yellow mm -hmm. but the fact that a game like this uh you know would happen at low yellow i was actually i was so excited i was like wow low yellow like thank goodness i was this low in yellow mm -hmm. to have a game like that it wasn't even it wasn't too low. It was around 1300 actually, which you know a lot of people consider uh, pretty bad. But I don't play a, a lot of ranked games, or I play ranked games with my friends that are very bad. I try and you know carry them or like give them some advice for rank. But mm -hmm. I was just so excited to be in that game at that time. It yeah. was it was really fun. It it looks like it was a lot of fun. You guys did an amazing job. All all of your teammates were you know doing pretty damn good doing pretty good working as a team and you guys came back from a huge disadvantage I think um, the worst disadvantage you could have next to you know another person yeah. another person doing that's the only thing that could be worse yeah so yeah, well man thanks for uh, joining in on this commentary we're gonna have to do this again sometime yeah definitely we'll play some more games together thanks for sharing the uh, the awesome action and we're gonna have to do some action together as well um, for the viewers now, thank you guys for watching this video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed us, and we'll uh, see you guys next time. Yep, see ya. That's it, man. <laughs> that was fun.